Hi everyone, welcome back to Order 15 Development Tutorials. In this video, let us discuss about reporting dashboard in Order 15. In generally, we were creating dashboard using JS and CSS files. So today let us discuss how to create dashboard using simple Python and XML files. So let's try to create that dashboard in our travel management module. So let's try to create a travel dashboard. So let's directly go to PyCharm. So in the PyCharm under the travel management custom module in the views, let's create a new XML files travel dashboard.xml and at here let's try to add new menu for dashboard so I am simply adding a menu item and then giving its parent as travel menu which is the menu item id of travel management module and then just giving a sequence and then just updating a action for it So now the menu item is ready and then let's define its action. And then update its and update action under ir actions dot active window and then let's update the name for our dashboard So I am updating it as travel dashboard and then let's add the rest model so at here let's update the model as board dot board which is a model which can be used for uh, creating the dashboards we have already seen a dashboard uh, module uh, in order uh, I will show it in the ui so in the apps we can see a module for dashboard so board so let's add uh, this up uh, add this model as the model for that action so i updating rest model as board dot board and then adding this it in the manifest too and then let's return back to our travel dashboard xml file and then add the view mode updating the view mode uh, i'm just adding it as form and then next thing is about usage field name usage you can update it as menu and then next uh, let's add view id here let's add the view id for our dashboard view so for example i am adding this travel dashboard view. so now the act, uh, action for the, now the menu and the action for the menu is ready and then let's define the view for our dashboard so let's create the record for our dashboard view so record id which is already we have added at here that is travel dashboard view so we can update at it at here and then update its model ir.ui.view ui 
dot view and then let's create the name for our dashboard and also the model for our view so I am updating the same model that we have called for our action that is board dot board and then next the type of our view which is form and then let's try to add the form and then I am adding it as string as travel dashboard itself and then uh, next is the steps to create our dashboard so first let's add a board style at here I am adding currently I am adding the board style as one iPhone 2 uh, I will show it once uh, let's update it in the UI and then at here let's add the column under the column we can define what type of the views for example the graph calendar tree so what type of views that we needed in our dashboard can be added at here under column so under column here we can define the action that we needed so I am defining the action first let's define the string so first I am trying to add the tree tree form a tree view of uh, the travel so I am adding the string as travel tree and then uh, under the name we can define its action so let's add here let's define the action that we uh, declared earlier for our uh, travel management module that is action travel so I am updating that action at here so likewise we can update the action if we need a particular width or height for this uh, particular uh, travel tree we can define it at year 2 and then uh, let's add this uh, file under the manifest and then uh, let's run the PyCharm and then let's check how this dashboard will works so under the manifest I am updating this use travel underscore dashboard dot xml file and then let's run the PyCharm and in the UI let's upgrade the module of our travel management so upgraded the module and then let's open the travel dashboard so at here we can see our travel tree it is updated at here Likewise, we can update uh, another uh, view forms and the view types also like calendar, graph, etc. So let's try to create a graph view and then let's try to show it in the uh, dashboard. So let's return back to our PyCharm. So at here, let's define a action for our graph view. So let's create a record for our graph view. Under the model of ir.actions.window. And then uh, our model is we are uh, defining the graph view under our model travel dot travel. So I am updating it as travel dot travel. And then uh, let's define the view mode, which is graph. 
and then let's add the view id which we are uh, going to add our graph view so i am adding it as graph travel and then at here let's define our graph view and then ids that we are updated that is graph underscore travel and then model which is travel dot travel and then next the type uh, and then type which is graph and then fill in equal to arc type equal to xml and then let's add our graph view first let's define the graph string and then let's add the type and here I'm, i am adding the type as pi it is i am going to define a pi graph and if you need to uh, load the sample records we can define the sample and then at here we can add the field name uh, currently uh, now i am loading the destination also let's try to create a, a pie graph based upon the destinations so i am adding the field destination so now the so now the graph view is ready and then le uh, let's add that graph view in our dashboard so at here uh, let's add and if you if you need another column we can need add another column or otherwise we can add it as a another action under that particular action travel tree so i am adding another action uh, which has of name i am updating it as graph view and then let's give its name let's give its name it's graph views uh, name is as action graph view which is the id of particular graph view so i am adding that view at here so now the graph view is also added to the dashboard and then let's run the pie charm and then upgraded the module so now we can see the graph view is also updated at here Likewise, we can create a calendar, pivot, form and any other views for our travel dot travel model and then we can update those uh, views actions in our dashboard view and we can create a dashboard using simple python and xml files. Also at here the change layout, we can change its layout. So currently I am added it as uh, board style is given as 1 iPhone 2 we can update it as 2 iPhone 1 and then we can check how it shows so so 2 iPhone 1 so uh, the here at, uh, left side portion it to have 2 is the style so more length and then at here it is shortest likewise we can change different different layout And then if you need to uh, drag and drop, we can drag and drop here. Or if you need to minimize, we can minimize here. Or if you need to add, we can add at here. And then also we can at here drag and drop. And if you need to close this, we can simply close this item. So likewise, we can create reporting dashboards in order 15 using simple Python and XML files. So I hope you got about how to create reporting dashboards in order 15.